I've been very lucky to be involved with some incredible individuals through sport. But I thought about this and was thinking back to the very beginning um, and where I started. And like um, they said earlier, I played with the boys for my first year. So when I finally did get to play with girls, I was very excited. Um, and we, I played in East Bay, and we had uh, a rival team up in Marin. So my very first year playing with girls, and we were um, against this team, this girl, I walked in, she's 6'2", her name was Ellen, and I'm like, oh my gosh. She was the center, and I was the defender, which means I had to stop her from scoring, and her only mission was to put that ball in the goal. I was like, oh my, oh my lord, what's happening right now? And we then ensued this very, very fierce competition. Um, and this is all I knew about her. And that's the one thing about sports that you forget, that we're out there trying to be the best athletes we can be and, and be the best for our team. And so is the other team. So I looked over at her, and, and to be honest, I was scared. I was like, this girl wants to kill me. <laughs> and this, this competition followed me from high school to college. I went to Berkeley, she went to Stanford. Woo, uh oh. <laughs> and it was fierce all the way through those years. And one, um, the, our freshman year, we're against each other, we're going at it. And I didn't know much more about her other than what I experienced in the pool, which happens a lot. Um, and we're in a game, and she goes, she's going for it, she's got these long, lanky elbows, and she nails me in the face, dislocating the jaw. I'm like, whoa, wow, she really does hate me. I'm like, this is nuts. And I got out of the pool, hurting quite a lot, but knowing this is part of the game, and this is what transferred my whole life and my whole perspective, perspective of athletes from this moment. She got out of the pool, not understanding that she had hit me. The minute she found out, she came over with her mom to apologize and say, I'm really sorry, I didn't know I did that, and how can I help you? And I stopped and I looked at her. This fierce competitor, this person I had been going against for years and years and years, was the first person to come ask me if I needed help. That was incredible. And that opened my vision up to the idea of what a competitor is. It's not someone who just wants to score against you. These people are people too, who want to be the best person they're trying to be as well. And from that day on, we became the best of friends. We became teammates on the national team, went to Olympics together, I was in her wedding. She's an incredible individual, and I realized that that's what sports allows you to do. It gives you an opportunity to not only learn about someone and what they're like in the water or on the field, but also as a person away from the water. 